Today I'm going to unbox this huge box because my mom ordered something huge. So let's find out what my mom ordered. So first I'm gonna put it down on the chair so I can open it. This is really heavy. All right, let's get the box cutter and start cutting. This is a lot of tape. There we go. Here. Now on the other side. Thank you. And it's I did it. box open. So first thing that's in here, oh that's really heavy, is six cupcake maker. So it bakes up to six cupcakes at a time. This is so cool. Now I can bake cupcakes for everybody and I don't have to worry about burning myself. So I'm really happy that I got this and we bake six cupcakes at a time, which is really cool. So, see, and also they rise a lot because in the picture, it looks like the cupcakes are gonna rise and they look perfectly baked. So it says, bakes up in six cupcakes at a time. Power on and ready indicator lights. Non-stick deep cooking plates and storage security latch. So you can lock it as well. That's cool. All right, let's open this cupcake maker. Let's take off the tape. All right, lift it up. Let's take this out. Here it comes. Whoa, it's huge. These are the instructions. That's, so this is what it looks like. It's, it's red and it's really cool. So it has the plug here. still cooking and if the green light is on then that means it's done so let's open it up okay whoa you can make like so much cupcakes and they're really big you can make six that's really cool look at that that's awesome it's like a huge mouth <laughs> and we got some styrofoam <laughs> let's read the instruction manual so it tells us for our safety, important safeguards, and it tells us about the indicator lights. It says a caution, steam will be emitted when opening the cupcake maker, take extreme care. So gotta be careful. Getting to know your fantastic cupcake maker. So there's how to use before, first use, cleaning instructions, to clean it, pretty much. <gasps> recipes, guys, look, there's recipes. There's chocolate frosting, I'm a... So, serving size makes 12 cupcakes. So that's basic vanilla cupcakes. Where are the chocolate ones? <laughs> oh, it's just the vanilla ones, but you can make chocolate icing on them. So I love chocolate, chocolate's my fave. So, it says the ingredients for chocolate icing, the chocolate frosting, buttercream ingredients and method. 
cream cheese, frosting, and a basic vanilla cupcake. So that's really, really cool. Maybe I can make a video on remaking them. That's cool. Now let's take out the second thing that's in here. Yeah. Whoa. So inside we have, let's see if I can read it upside down. Teppanyaki, teppanyaki and BBQ grill. So it's a grill, that's really cool. Tap, teppanyaki and BBQ grill. So you can grill yummy barbecues and teppanyaki, which looks really good. We could use this when we go out in the backyard on like a summer's day. So what we have here is the Mistral Teppanyaki and Barbecue Grill. It says here, large die cast aluminum non-stick cooking surface. Warming drawer keeps food hot and ready to serve. Drip away excess grease for healthier grilling. Cook, keep warm and serve all in one cool touch handles and 2000 W. So let's, let me show you the side. Gonna... So it says some instructions here. It says one, large, di large die cast aluminum non-stick cooking surface. Two, adjustable and removable temperature control probe. Number three, warming jar keeps food hot and ready to serve. Number four, removable grease catcher for easy cleaning. So it says do not Im Okay, so this is, I'll show you guys the other side. Oh. <laughs> So it says the same thing here, here. It says the same thing on the other side. All right, guys, now let's open it and see. Let's take the tape off. Take the tape off. Yeah. And then we lift it up. There's also a handle here for the box. Alright, let's put it here, and then start to pull it out. Ah. Ooh. <laughs> so we got some more bubble wrap. <laughs> Yay! So this is what it looks like so far. This is huge. What's this? So we have this. I think it's some... It's self-control thermostat. So I think it's the, a thermometer. So let's get it out so you guys can see it. So this is what it looks like. It's a black color and there's someone covering the plug here. So to be careful. So it's a self-control thermostat. So this part, you have to plug it into this, into the grill, and then you plug this in, and then it's good to go with your grilling. So it, I'll put it right, ooh, I'll put it right here. So you can start. Okay. Let's remove it out of. So we got the instructions. So let's check the instruction manual. So it also says important safeguards. And it says here, these are, this is the grease trough, this part. 
This part is the drip opening. And this is the non-stick cooking plate. This is the temperature regulator. And it's up and it has an indicator light on it right here. And it's a temperature control unit with power cable. And then there's, uh, and then this is the dip pan right here. So you just take it out and slide it. You just slide it out just like that. So that's really easy. So it tells you about getting to know your grill and before first use. And then it says cleaning, maintenance, specification, cooking guide. So the food here is chicken breast, heat setting two to three, cooking time three to four minutes each side. And then sausages, two to three, heating setting as well. And three minutes. Lamb chops, three to four, heating setting, four minutes each side. I like the lamb chops. So this is really big. What's this? Oh, it had a little red dot on it. Okay. So guys, this is the warming jar. So when you're done grilling your food, you put it down here. You take it, put it down here, and then you can just cook something else while it's getting warm under the grill, which is super cool. And so, when it's greasy or something, the grease will just flow over here and then fold down this hole into this and then you can kind of, and then you can wash it. You can wash it and then reuse it as many times as you want. So that's, that's really cool. I love this grill. So this grill can be used in the inside or outside and you can and we can use this when it's summer so we'll make we'll probably make a video on that and we'll show you guys how to use it like the cupcake maker so i'm really excited for those videos so just wait for those so i hope you guys have enjoyed this video please like and subscribe and hit that notification button to be fully updated when i upload videos like this bye